Hi, I'm Otsu 82 we're out here in Ibiza 2017. Ibiza. Ibiza! I think we all share the same passion for Ibiza. Uh, mine is I just love raving, so this is my third year. The first time I came three years ago, I actually did the panel and did the adult villa, uh, the after party afterwards, which was really great. I was a little bit nervous the first time I did it. It was a panel and I didn't really know what to expect, but I'm doing it again this year, so I'm really excited this time, a little bit more prepared. What I'm going to play? Yeah, what do you do? Do you have any music? <laughs> Watch TV. Ah. <laughs> No, I'm joking. Uh, to be honest, I kind of, this sounds really bad actually, I kind of wing it where I'm a very unorganised person. I don't really, I don't really plan things. Mm -hmm. Everything is just a spur at the moment and I've always checked the DJ sets like that. Obviously the music that I have is music that I've purchased and collected over the years so I know where it is on the pen drives or in the record bag, whatever. So I don't really feel the need to, to plan sets. I just plug and play and, and, and see where it takes me. Hopefully it takes me somewhere nice. Everyone's mental, aren't they? <laughs> Everyone's in a really nice, nice attitude. Whereas in England, everyone's just proper going at it. But that's something that I love about you know British clubs and festivals. People really have it. You know, whether you go to DC Ten on a Monday or a Wednesday or whatever, or Amnesia, you can always tell when people are British because they're always at the front and they're always really having it. And it's uh, I really love that. So UK festivals, there's always a really good vibe and people are always dancing. I have this new one by uh, Zoo Brazil. It's called Sand and it has a lot of like kalimbas in it. It's really summer record, really driving record. It's really nice as well. It's uh, Christopher Wicked Games. Yeah, we know that one, don't we? I'm not singing it. <laughs> I nearly did then. <laughs> DJ sets about taking the, the crowd on a journey. If you can achieve that in two, three, four hours or whatever, it's, it's, that's, for me, that's what a DJ is all about. So I was always in, uh, in this mindset of taking someone on a journey. If you can take it somewhere magical, then you've achieved something good, I think. Especially at the IMS, a lot more female DJs kicking around as well, which is always nice. Especially in an industry that's always been dominated by male, it's, it's refreshing uh, to see to see females around. I mean, like, obviously, like La Fleur, she's my resident, and it's me personally. I always like to see a female in the DJ booth, and especially if they're talented like La Fleur as well. It's uh, it, it's it's great. It's nice to see more women pushing through as well. Where Hi, I'm Watson 82 we're out here in Ibiza 2017 with Ticketmaster and this summer you can catch me at Creamfields. See you there. Who's a pro? Who's a pro?